Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome to another Python tutorial video. My name is Jay. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a Python program to merge PDF files. So yesterday I downloaded a couple of larger files, which is are in PDF format. So here, let me show you guys the PDF file that I just downloaded yesterday. I was going to some of the notes uh, from this professor. I've got his name, but uh, he has multiple PDF files. I want to combine all the PDF files into one single file, but unfortunately, I don't have uh, Adobe Acrobat or any third-party software to do that, and I don't want to use any online free tools. So I decided to simply write a program to merge my PDF files. So right here, I have several lecture files. So as you can see, that uh, I have eight PDF files that I want to combine into one single file. Now let me go back to my Python editor. And here I have my demo.py script creator. So the library that I'll be using uh, to perform any PDF operations, such as splitting PDF pages, merge PDF files, insert different uh, PDF file pages, and so on. And this is the library I'm using currently. So pypdf2. And to install the library, you want to use the commands pip install pypdf2. And that's it. So that will install the library. Now let me go back to my folder. So here are my files. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to import my libraries. I'll import the OS module. And from pypdf2 module, I want to import the PDF file. It should, should be capital F, merger class. Next, I want to create a variable, point to my source folder. So I'll name this variable source uh, dir. And I can use the OS module dot get cwd to return the current working directory. Next, I want to create a PDF file merger instance. I'll name the instance merger. So merger -E is equals to PDF merger. It should PDF file merger. Now, what we need to do is we need to uh, iterate all the files in this folder. And to do that, I can use the OS module again dot list. DIR and this function will return all the files and folders path given the directory that you provide. So I'll provide my source directory. And here I'm going to iterate uh, each item one by one. So here I'm going to say for item in OS dot list DIR and followed by the source directory. And I want to insert an if condition. Here I'm going to say that if item name ends with PDF. I only want to merge the PDF files. I want to add those file paths to my merger uh, object. So merger .append, and I want to provide the uh, the file path. In this case, will be item object. And once that's finished, we can take the merger object and save the final file. So here I'm going to use the write method followed by the file name. I want to name this file uh, lecture uh, complete dot PDF. And once we're finished, we need to close the instance. And that's it. Let me save the the complete file to my output folder. So output all by lecture complete dot PDF. Now if I save and run the script, so here I have an error. And here I'm getting name PDF is not defined. Oh, so this should be string. So PDF. And I notice another typo. So ends with. Let me try again. So if I save and run it. And here's my lecture complete PDF file. And let me open the file and we can just take a look. So here's the PDF file. Okay. So here we have lecture 10. Now if I search for lecture, lecture 11, and here's the second PDF file. So overall, after the merge process, this file has 375 pages of notes that I need to go to either today or tomorrow. But yeah, so that's everything I want to share in this video. Just a very simple script that can be very useful uh, when it comes to the right centration. And for the future video, so this, so let me show you guys an app that I'm working on based on the PyQt5 framework. 
this is the application I'm currently building. So let me just give you guys a quick demo. So this is a very simple PDF uh, utility manager. Using this application, I can take all the files. I can drag all the files to my application. So here I'll drag to my application. And this application will validate uh, each file type and you will only accept PDF file. And I can click on browse and choose the, the file name that I want to save to. So here, let's say I want to save the file as lecture py. And when I click on merge, and I'll perform the merge process and it gives me this pop up window. And once I go to my output folder, and here's my lecture py.pdf file. So this is one of the applications I'm working on and I'll be making a tutorial showing you guys how to build this application uh, from scratch but for now I'm still working on some of the functionalities and the uh, interface. Alright, so this is everything and as always, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys on the next video.